Now, CBS4 weather. Meteorology Day morning for Craig today, and the real-time Doppler is uh, seeing just a few showers, maybe a thunderstorm developing in the interior there along the Gulf Coast. It's a line of showers here with a front which is trying to push south. It has become stationary here and not really impacting our weather much. These showers have developed over the last hour. They're pretty stationary, and that thin little green line is the cooler air coming out of this storm, but it's fighting that east breeze, so not really making its way much farther there into uh, Broward County. I have a few showers that have move through the lower keys. You might get a brief shower there is moved by that breeze. So any rain shower that's around quickly moves out. Now conditions along the coast will be changing quite a bit here over the next few days. Say it's a cold front, but the biggest impact will be that breeze could drop our temperature a degree or two, but a strong northeast uh, wind will be developing tomorrow and continuing Friday. Rough surf, likely seeing some rip currents, maybe some hazard for boaters there. So pay attention to that. If you're along the coast here the next few days, upper 80s, we were at 90 degrees. The average high is 85. Even though it's cold front, I don't think our temperatures will drop much more than uh, where they were today. they will drop into the 70s overnight tonight. Breezy at times and overnight you could sit a passing shower. They develop off the coast and move with that breeze east to northeast about 10 miles an hour. It's about where we are right now, so it will continue. Won't go calm here overnight tonight. Start to pick up just a bit and really gets gusty tomorrow. Uh, the satellite and radar shows the showers in place, but as we zoom out here, you can see this line of clouds extending all the way out to the Atlantic. Temperatures up to the northern part of the state have dropped about 10 to 15 degrees. We will not see a drop like that. Uh, by the time it gets here, not much of an impact with our temperatures, and it's pretty much getting uh, fairly stationary right now. So it's a front off the coast, but there's that stationary front, the breeze picking up to the north of it. It's not here yet. Uh, it really starts to change tomorrow as that high area of high pressure builds in and that wind starts to pick up. Here come the clouds and the showers racing by mainly in the morning, but they'll work their way throughout the through the afternoon and evening uh, and they're moving pretty quick. So uh, passing showers likely the breeze continues again on Friday. Not much of a change there. Still some rain around. We're watching an area of low pressure developing here in the Gulf. It does have the potential to develop. This is our tropics outlook. It could move to the north over the next three to five days. Be careful on the water. East wind 10 to 15 knots, three to five foot seas, choppy on the bays. The extended forecast uh, was still a bit breezy on Friday, but by Saturday and Sunday, the moisture increases. So more storms are in the forecast over the weekend and into next week. Dave, thanks a lot.